Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, it's a more power world. We're going to start continuing on this base, getting like a second and maybe a third layer. So with that said, let's get into this. I'm again playing on my Xbox Series S. To switch weapons, you have to press the Y button versus the pickaxe, then the X, and then as far as I know, you can hold up to like four different weapons. But oh, looks like our axis needs to be repaired. Hopefully, I have the materials I need. And boom. Yeah, might as well repair this as well. Anyway, I guess I should talk about my animations. Right now, I am currently working on... I don't know if you guys have seen Shallon Showdown, but I like the characters there, so I'm creating the Evil Wish Booya. Quick note from the future. By the time I was finishing editing this, I have already finished creating Booya. I already have the front, side, Angle views and back are done. And I, as I mentioned in the video, I used Torio's outfit as the base to make Wuya's outfit. I just wanted to share that info. I already like created the head. And as for the body, I am using my Toriel body as the base. Well, particularly the dress she wears. But it is technically the outfit. So I already have the front and angle view. Now I just have to work on the side view. As for the head, it's already created. And speaking of the heads, trying to find a front view, angle view, and a side view of Booya wasn't exactly easy. Okay, I'm wanting out of space, so let's build up our base then. Okay, for personal reasons, I think this inner part will be our courtyard. So, with that said, let's head into here. And grab that and stick that there so we can actually. And we're just gonna put a few walls up, particularly this one. And if I hit the Y button, it basically just places walls. And I don't have to go back and get more. I'm just going to do this. Okay. I should add another little platform there. Hopefully I can. Yes, I can. Here we go. Basically, this episode was just building up our base and the more we build it up the more experience points we get each time we place one down we get more experience points at least that's what I believe and it's looking good I'm gonna add a few windows on the inside as well so I can actually look out towards the inner part of my base That actually looks like a nice view. I think I can add another little... Actually, yeah. I already checked it out and I can actually put something over it to make sure it actually works. 
well just building up all anyway getting back to my cartoons I am working on the Five Nights at Freddy's parody but at the current moment I am stumped I don't know what should happen next I mean I do want to enter the bat animatronic introduce him I do have this idea I'm thinking of basically I'm thinking that the bat animatronic sees like these two little kids like I don't know fighting over a soft drink and I already explained that the uh, bat animatronic basically has kind of a hero complex he just wants to like help people out and stuff basically he's like the Glamrock Freddy of my parody that's not bad we can actually have we can actually continue our base up there yeah let's do that and I just messed up here just trying to knock that down am I even making any damage? I can't tell I don't see the health bar here. They must have had some kind of update that removed the health bar. Or if it's still showing it, I don't know where they're showing it from. Seriously? Okay, definitely it's not the axe. It's like they made it so once you place down a wall you can't destroy it. Is that what they're saying to me? I got skill points. I should use them. Oh, okay, that was weird. Alright, do I have any food? Yes, I do. And boom. There we go. Full health. Okay. Come on. Destroy it already. How am I going to get rid of this thing if it just won't destroy? Maybe I can work with this. Seeing that it won't let me destroy it, I guess I could just work around it. Literally. And boom. Okay. So let's build a staircase. Um, okay, uh, place that down there. Okay, I think what I need to do. Yeah, I definitely gonna need to add another floor here just to make it easy to get around and this will be like a little nook area maybe I can like put like, like a little chest here or something I don't know right now I'm just all oh, out of ammunition not ammunition out of wood I really should get another pal so I can plant the seeds so my pals can be fully able to feed themselves so maybe I should just make some power balls power spears I keep forgetting what the names are oh I only have 33 I just saw that so I think what I should do is just Cut down this tree. Yeah, my axe is damaged. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is basically 
and we fixed my axe, and I don't have enough stones. So let's get some stones. Should be able to get enough from here. Our base is looking pretty good. I mean, it's our base will be going up there, and I think that's where I'll have my house planted. Okay, I should have enough to repair my axe. Okay, yep. Boom and boom. Can I repair this? No, I do not. I wonder if I got the wall in here. I only got four. Well, let's take that wall and make some fabric. Then we can repair my shirt. Okay, make it the maximum amount, and boom. I should increase my speed for building stuff. I really should do that. Yeah, let's do that. We're going to here. Here we go, increase. Oh wait, it looks like it's 200. Okay, now if we go back into here, you see that I am crafting it a lot faster now. Way faster than it would. Now that little taskbar, I think that indicates the durability of our workstation. And once it gets down to a certain stage, It's damaged. Okay. Also, it turns out you can't just you just can't um be another piece of clothing and put in the stores away. It just automatically brings it into your. S we got a chicken. Uh, do I have a chicken? Yeah, I have two chickens. Wait. Okay. So this is the one we need to find now. Because he will be able to plant the seeds for us. And... Usually he's down below. Very below. So... I have to be... Super. Ah, there they are. Okay. Go down the A button to crouch. And perfect. If these little things see me, they literally will go running away. Fortunately, if another one spots me, Oh, damn it. Oh. You're being too powerful. Okay. Let's see. Capture! Ooh, a fire pal. That should heat things up. Pun told the intendant. It would be funny if this thing evolves into a Nine Tails. Ow. Ah, damn it. 
I think I need to get fire resistant clothes for them. Okay, so that's where I died, so let's respawn there.